<clears throat> Cheers. Um. Out of milk, again. Is that so? No, it's just itchy. Can't wait to get rid of it. It's a problem for you, isn't it, having Roberts there? No. Not how you think, anyway. Morning. See you later. Awkward. Just staying the one night. What did you do to make her kick you out, hmm? I'm assuming that she doesn't know what went on between you and my son. No, she's no idea, and it's not about that. Well, you're not stopping. I'm pretty sure Diane gets to say too. But a bit of luck, we won't need to put it to the test. You're going groveling to your wife? Well, I wouldn't call it that, but yeah, hopefully I'll be checking out today. Missing you already. Free bar through there if you want cheering up. Paddy told me that he'd done his surrogate dad bit. Yeah? Yeah, all right, I was thinking of getting off, but I'm not now. Just, I can't stand the sight of him anymore. Love and hate, fine line and all that. Yeah, that's just the thing, it's just hate with us. I've been there. This is different. Carl lied constantly cheated on me but I kept on going back for more because I believed in him well, I'm not you you are more like me than either of us want to admit but I am so scared that he's gonna turn out to be your Carl I reckoned I had my head screwed on too but every single time I would come up with excuses for him whatever he'd done I'd kid myself it's different this time he means it he's gonna change Hope is a dangerous thing. I used to think you were off your head, you know, sticking with him. I get it now. And I'm not going to be like that. Good. But promise me, love, that you will ignore him. Because chances are he is going to try and make you his go-to person for when he's feeling down. Well, I can handle him. By steering well clear, though, right? Because game playing never ends well. And he thrives on it. Yeah, well, it doesn't matter. 